grab two of these pencil holders and you're gonna go ahead and grab your hot glue and just put it all the way around once you're done putting all the glue around just grab the other one and attach them together to hold it in place just like that then after you do that you're just gonna go ahead and get these um beads um on dollar tree as well you're just gonna go ahead and put some hot glue in there and you're gonna go ahead and put hot glue and attach like that make sure to hold it a little bit down on this part so then it won't come apart so just go ahead and continue putting all your beads until you're done doing the whole thing and you will do the top and you also will do the bottom as well then once you're done do putting the beads this is how it will turn out just like this super cute you guys then i went ahead and grabbed this petal and i'm gonna go ahead and put it inside in here where you're going to do it just instead of putting the whole thing just put half of it and then put the flower that you want to display and then put the another petal put, um, put it on top of the flower so the the flower could be in the middle and then the petal on top and then you're just gonna go ahead and continue doing this until you do the whole thing then go ahead and grab a piece of paper on pink and then just measure it to the color and then just go ahead and mark it down and then you're just gonna go ahead and cut it out you're gonna need two of these i did not show you in the video but then just put one for from each side because then you're gonna, gonna have a gap in between or you could just put one in the middle and make sure the petal doesn't come out like that you see like the little gap and thing. so make sure to place two for each side just like that then once you do that then this is how beautiful you guys it turns out and then go ahead and grab your flamingo and they light up super cute and place it and make a little heart and this is how beautiful it turns out you guys i can't wait to show you the whole setup i'm planning a flamingo's birthday party coming up so i'm just gonna be doing a few diys for you guys so then I cannot wait to show you the whole decorations, how everything turns out. So for the next year where I grab one of these um, bags and then the petals as well, I'm just gonna go ahead and grab my hot glue and attach it to the bottom of the bag. In here, as you can see, I'm doing it like sideways, but I recommend to do it straight because the one that I did straight looks better than the one that you do with sideways. So then you're just gonna go ahead and continue um, gluing your, your petal. Make sure the first petal that you do, you do put um, hot glue on both sides and then attach it and then you put another one on top standing up like that. So it can look super cute and you have no gap. Then grab your flamingo head and place it on top just like that and then continue filling it up your, um, your bag until you're done doing the whole thing then you're gonna see wherever you have the little gap that you think is missing one just gonna take your hot glue and put it inside and this is how it fits on style you guys for the next diy i grab one of these candle holder and one of these plastic container i'm just gonna go ahead and put some hot glue at the top of the candle holder and then just go ahead and place it on top and attach it in place then i went ahead and grabbed one of these cup holders super cute flamingo and i'm just gonna go ahead and inflate it and i grabbed these um flower ring that they have and then i just took the other flowers to i could and then i bought this branch of flowers and i'm just gonna go ahead and place it around to whichever color you want or whatever flower you want to put in here that's your decision then once i'm done i'm just gonna go ahead and place this on top i did it three different ways so just stay into the end so you can see how i arrange it you could do it like this or you could do it like where you put the two flower on top or you could do it without it so then after i do that i'm just gonna go ahead and pour some water in the container and then place, place my flamingo on top just like that i also forgot to put the beads the gold ones so just don't forget to go all the way around and do these around the tray and this is how beautiful it turns out this is the first look how it looks with the big flowers and the tray and it came out super cute another way that you can do is just put the flower at the bottom and the flamingo on top with just one flower super cute for the next year why i grab one of these containers i'm gonna go ahead and put some shredded paper inside and then you don't have to put paper if you would don't like you just could put the candy but then you could put whatever candy you would like um toys whatever could fit in this and it would look super cute i decided to do this for the boy and then the bag for the girls so so i don't have to give the same stuff to the girls and boy so then once you fill it up just go ahead and close your little container just like that and then to make it extra cute i grabbed this bag of cookies or whatever you have and it came out super cute you guys this is how everything turns out i hope you guys like it and thank you for watching special creations finally